Hey guys, Extended here, and today I am bringing you guys a comparison video of Yaya Torre from Manchester City and Juan Mata from Chelsea. They're both rated 86, one's a cam, one's a CM, but in the clips that you are going to be seeing, um, I put both of them in the CM position in a 4-4-3. So let's start off with, or 4-3-3. Let's start off with their price. Um, on Xbox, Torre is 29,000 and Mata, Mata, however you want to say it, he's only 19k, so it's about a 10k difference um, between the two players. As you can see, down by Mata's one Mata. I'll just say Mata. By Mata's score or skills, his first six or seven are green, um, and then Traore's or Torre's bottom numbers are better than Mata's. Um, I think it's because Matt Mata is a. I'll just call him Juan. Juan, he's better. At attacking and Torre he's a better defensive player let's look at their physical stats of course Juan has way better stats having five greens compared to Torre's three but the ones that Torre does have in green they're high 85 93 and 92 and when you are going down the pitch with Torre it's really good because he has 92 strength and 93 stamina so you won't really lose a lot of of his fitness um, compared to Juan where he has good acceleration, agility, and balance, and his sprint speed's good, but without that strength, he only has 56 strength, he gets pushed off the ball a lot. Um, Shooting-wise, uh, Juan has better stats. He has 83 finishing, 81 free kicks. Um, okay, long passing with 71, and compared to Torre, he only has 68 finishing, 65 free kicks, and 78 long shots. Um, Torre has way better passing. He has he has, although it says on both their cards that it's 80, he has 83 passing compared to um, Juan's, let's see, or long passing compared to Juan's 71. And short passing, Juan has 86, and so does Torre. Um, defense wise, Torre has 81 stand, or sliding tackle and 83 standing, while Juan only has 16 slide tackling and 22 standing tackling, which is very, very bad. Going to their mental stats, Torre has three greens and one yellow compared to Juan's two reds and two greens. Uh, Torre is better in everything except for positioning and their tied provision, so their passing is going to be okay. And their opposites in weak foot and skill moves with Torre with a four star weak foot and three star skill moves. And um, Juan has three star weak foot and four star skill moves. Heading. It says that Torre has better heading, and that makes sense because he's a lot taller. He's about 17 centimeters taller than him. And this is the part where it shows that Torre is better as a defensive player. He has medium attack work rates and high defensive work rates compared to Juan, who has medium attacking work, rate, work rates and medium defensive work rates. And you'll see on the other... You can see on the screen their stats that they got in the three games that I played with them. Torre had one goal compared to Juan's four. Assist, Torre had one. Um, Juan had zero. Passing, uh, Torre had 79% compared to Juan's 89. Rating, their average rating in the three games, Torre got 7.2 compared to Juan's 8.5. And man of the matches, Juan got one com compared to Torre zero. So yeah, um, this was my comparison between Yaya Torre and Juan Mata. Uh, in this video, Juan looks like he pulled really far away from Torre and yeah, he did way better than him. And he's overall the better player right now, although I like Yaya Torre. And Juan's also 10k cheaper, so if you guys would like to pick up a nice CM or cam, pick him up and see what he can do for you. So if you guys like this series and this video, please comment, like, and subscribe, and I will bring more to you guys. So yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. See ya.